Hi friends and families, welcome back to my kitchen, Meals with Mills. In this episode, I'll be showing you how to make brown pancakes or pancake la fuboko and salmon. Uh, so let's get started with the recipe. to subscribe, like uh, and comment to any of the videos that I'll be sharing with you and if you're new to my channel please subscribe thank you for visiting and watching my videos in the meantime let's start cooking so I have three cups of self roasting flour I have milk powder half a cup of desiccated coconut half a cup of sugar quarter teaspoon of salt, half a cup of milk powder, one egg and about one and a half to two cups of water. I will mix all the ingredients together this on the side. add the sugar as well, the salt. and the coconuts. Give it a good mix. I will dip the egg a little bit. Okay, just make a well in the middle of the bowl of the flour. Add your egg. And then start adding your water slowly and mix it. Okay. Okay. I can smell the coconut already. Add a little bit more water. You don't have to add the coconut, but this is how I like it. I like to add coconut to my pancake. Okay, add a little bit more water and mix it around. Add a little bit more water. Okay. Everyone, the reason why, let me explain why I, I use a fork to to mix. I find it, it mixes the flour well with the other ingredients. That's just my observation, but the spoon works. I think a spoon works. Perfect. So our oil is uh, almost ready. Okay, as you can see, I just put a chopstick in here and you can see the oil is bubbling. That means our oil is ready and we are ready to uh, fry our pancakes. I don't know if you can see. In goes the pancake. Let it drop in the oil. And if the oil gets too hot, you can turn the, the oven down. keep turning them around. Don't worry about these little um, crunchy, you know, these are my favorite parts. A lot of people like these. These are nice and crunchy. Doesn't matter about the shape. You know, if you make it for the first time and it doesn't turn out all right, trust me, when I first made um, 
learn to make uh, round pancakes. You wouldn't believe the size um, and the type I received. They're like um, little aliens at the time. But <clears throat> like they said, you know, practice makes perfect. The more you uh, practice doing something, the better you get. I guess it's the same with cooking. You just keep trying until you, um, you get it right. If it looks good, it tastes good, and if the family's happy, that's more important. gonna see if that pancake is cooked. Okay. Alright, so that came out a little bit um, white as you can see. So that means I need to cook it for a little bit longer. Let's check one more time. Okay. Okay, these are ready. I will these here. Drain the oil off a little bit longer and then you transfer it to um, a bowl with um, some towels to absorb the oil. Okay, right, that should be done. Should be right now. Okay. So everyone, um, I'm going to do something different here with pancakes. I'm going to add red food colouring. I normally add yellow, um, red um, to make colourful pancakes. Uh, but the reason why I add food colouring sometimes, um, the pancake doesn't um, cook too early and it gets burnt on the skin um, and, the, and the oil. So adding a drop of any food colouring you like red, yellow, I normally add. Um, we'll actually cook the pancake and it doesn't uh, get burned too quickly. So I'm just going to add a little bit of um, red food colouring to the rest of the mix. Try it with that. And then just mix it around. But just leave it plain if you like plain pancakes. I don't do it often, but sometimes it's a, a little you know, treat. The kids like colorful pancakes, just like they you know, enjoy colorful um, icing on the cupcakes. So it's the same thing with the pancake. I normally just add the coloring and um, Instead of the plain pancake, you can have a colourful pancake. The oil is ready. We're going to fry our red pancakes.
So our red colour pancakes are ready. Okay friends, families, uh, our pancakes are ready. So this is the red colour pancake and this is the plain colour pancake. So we normally like to have um, the plain one with butter and jam. And when it's nice and hot, come out of the, uh, the pot, uh, we would have it with butter and jam. I will cut one so you can see inside what it looks like nice and fluffy inside and firm too. Okay, so just add butter and then I'll just add jam. Put it together. Voila! Okay, a pancake with butter and jam. Um, I've also got a cup of coco, hot coco here. You can have it with hot Milo, hot chocolate, uh, but I'm having it with cup of hot cocoa, cocoa salmon. Okay, so I'll taste that one. Mmm, really nice. It's really nice with the hot cocoa. For the colour ones, I normally, um, I normally sprinkle a little bit of icing sugar on top. That's a red one, red colour pancake. Let me um let me show you what it looks like inside. Okay. So that's what it looks like inside. Our red color pancake. Add a little cocoa. Mm. <laughs> Excuse me. If you really, if you really like coconut, um, I reckon you will love um, adding coconut to your pancakes. I hope you. Um, enjoy watching um, this video please don't forget to subscribe share with your friends uh, comment if you like my recipe and for those who are new to the channel please don't forget to subscribe um, take care and i will catch up with you in the next video